Welcome everyone. Uh, uh, sorry, I haven't uploaded the uh, video for a while. I get a message that someone uh, need to install OpenSSH server and how to, to know what is the options and everything. So let's start here with a. Uh, this is a Windows machine here. So go for the start and go to the apps. Uh, go and apps and the uh, features. So here. Okay. Sorry. And this is apps and features selected. And here manage optional features. And add the features here. So going here, yes, and install. So also I need here this is a command line here. Command oh, command yeah and also like you don't need to run it every time I run so I kind of like open the file location for purposes here transit here make it run as administrator it will be much more easier for you every time to run it so and also I need here this is a uh, services I need it as well here. Let's try this one. So make sure that it's installing already here. So it's already installed. It's like it will take like one minute or something. So so here I'm going to search for it. You're going to find it here in the services. <clears throat> so uh, if you wanted to start it every time you start it manual, you can start it, but I'm going to make it as a automatic here and because it's like it's not running it like if you search for it like this and because it's the default port to the default port which is 22 so it's not running so here I'm going to start it and here if I execute the command again it will be running so it's running already now uh, the SSH so and already it has a SSH client both is running in the uh, Windows 10 so I'm kind like uh, I can now connect to my machine I need to know the IP address for my machine it's here so here this is a uh, IP address for my machine here so I'm going to connect and done so I can execute everything uh, like you're doing it with Ubuntu so it's like uh, and exit so uh, it's really really simple it's not that hard and also like you going here CD open SSH you're going to find all the configuration so it's like if you want to uh, know that which is a SSH CD here config and you're going to find here this is a if you want to change the port, if you want to change any of the configuration of the SSH, is similar to the uh, Open SSH in, uh, in Ubuntu. And also, if you want like a secure copy something, like if I did something like file .txt and uh, testing test the, test the copy, and here this is a secure copy here, and you select your file. And I'm going to client here and here like wh whatever you want like when whatever you want here like uh, for example if I choose here downloads here so like uh, I'm going to the downloads downloads ah sorry so just the password here ah sorry. So done, you can copy it from here and here. So it's really, really simple. And next time I'm going to show you, uh, I got also a message that someone uh, have a problem with uh, to monitor uh, his Windows 2008 with uh, Zavix. And also there are some uh, problem with a uh, with a video, one of the videos about Nagios as well, like there's someone, uh, I got a message also and I will make a video how to add the agent to uh, Nagios server and thank you really thank, really thank you for watching